know, it's hard work keeping in shape. But it's important to me to be the best that I can be and look the best that I can look. I don't go through all this to impress other people. I do it because I care about me. I care about my body and my health. But most importantly, I care about feeling good about myself. That's why I would never, ever take illegal drugs. You know, I've seen some people who smoke marijuana, and they seem to lose pride in their appearance. They lose their motivation to achieve. And let's face it, what goes in your body eventually shows up on the outside. The bottom line is stay away from drugs, but do it because you care about yourself. something out there. It's after kids everywhere. It entices them, confuses them, and can even kill them. That's right. Illegal drugs are everywhere. Cocaine coaxes you in, and then when you least expect it, it grabs you. You're hooked, and it's hard to get away. And have you seen what marijuana does to some people? Oh, yeah. You've seen them. Total burnout. It slows you down. It softens your mind. And in my neighborhood, you need to Move quickly and think fast. Drugs. It's a bloody shame. When I was 10 years old, my babysitter and her friends would do drugs in front of me. I really looked up to her. I wanted to be like her. I would talk her into letting me get high with them. That's all it took. After that, I moved on to pills, speed, cocaine, mushrooms. You name it, I took it. I had people that I used drugs with, but, you know, they weren't really friends. I would do anything to get it. Lie, cheat, steal. If I hadn't stopped using drugs, I would probably be in jail, dead, or on the street somewhere without a home. Phoenix House helped me change all that. My life is different now. I have a job. I, I'm going to school. The world is wide open to me. Take it from me. The only way to stop abusing drugs is to stop using them. Kid, I really want to let kids know that illegal drugs are bad news. Yes, David, it's true. Over 100,000 teenagers were admitted into hospitals last year because of drugs. Yeah, but I'm talking about kids' futures. Did you know that marijuana can affect a person's physical and sexual growth? Yes, that's quite accurate. In a laboratory test, female animals treated with the active component in marijuana experienced a 44% death rate among their offspring. This is much more important than facts and figures. What kids should know is that marijuana has got more cancer-causing agents than tobacco, and a lot of young kids use drugs on a daily basis. Actually, Michael, the fact is that one in 18 high school seniors smokes marijuana daily, and then there are the occasional users which account Get for... Get this through your CPU. They don't care about statistics. You know you're right. I've got it. Just tell them illegal drugs are bad, so don't mess with them. Illegal drugs are bad news. Don't mess with them. Jane makes her parents very proud. She's on the honor roll and plans to go to college. Starred in the class's last play. She plays clarinet in the school orchestra. Yes, Jane knows about drugs. In a way, she's lucky she knows better. Some people don't realize that marijuana and driving don't mix. But Jane's brother reminds her every day that some trips last forever. I get angry just thinking about it, it makes me mad. Little kids doing drugs, it turns my stomach. That stuff hurts. It stops you from living up to your potential. It holds you back. It hurts the user. It hurts his family. And it hurts his friends. I just want to shake some sense into you kids that are using drugs and think about using it. So remember, don't, or else, okay? <laughs> <laughs>